Good evening, folks. So we're back on the 2001 Toyota Silica with the um, misfire problem at low idle. The lacquer thinner trick to clean out the catalytic converter didn't work. So we're going to replace that, of course. So today we're going to remove the injectors, take a look at them, and drain the gas tank. So we removed the uh, fuel rail, pulled the injectors, and let's take a look. My Toyota dealership tells me the Denso brand is the original supplier of these injectors, and their computer works well with these injectors, and not to use any other brand. And in addition, never mix brands. Always use four Denzos uh, in this engine. This one, you can see the O-ring is chewed up there. Uh, from insulation and removal, so that's not good. It's missing a large washer. That one, the uh, O-ring is chewed up as well, missing a large washer. The outside casing is cracked. All of them are cracked. So you'll notice this one uh, has no markings whatsoever. No brand name, no part numbers. See, the supplier's not proud of it, apparently. This may well be the smoking gun. Toyota tells me their computer does not play well with generic injectors. So if you have one out of the four that is generic, more than likely it will never idle properly and it will encourage misfires. Here's the last one. The oil ring, of course, is chewed up there. This one appears to be more tarnished and some of the holes are plugged. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison. This is the end that goes in the engine head and you can tell that uh, one has a large washer, that's the generic one. The other three, that their original equipment, are totally missing those washers. So they've been lost at some point in time. So all four of these need to be replaced with OEM injectors. So before we replace the injectors and the catalytic converter, I wanna drain the fuel tank. We did run lacquer thinner through, and I wanna remove that and put fresh fuel in. So here's an easy way to do that. Just pull the EFI uh, relay and tell the fuel pump to start pumping. Uh-huh, working real well. So it's got almost five gallons of fuel in it, so we'll pump all of that out. And then once we get the new injectors and the uh, new catalytic converter, we'll bring you back for an install video. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, or dissent. You've been watching the Junkyard Tailgate channel. Good day.